So here I have two devices and I will transfer one dollar from this device to this device instantaneously. Enter the amount and send. I'm seeing the transaction now. And there it is. What you've just witnessed is what looks like a standard financial transaction. Money was transferred electronically from one account to another. But while it appears like an ordinary bank transfer, it may perhaps be the most revolutionary technology you're likely to see in your lifetime. This technology is called Bitcoin. Money makes possible the exchange of many different goods and services among many different people. Wherever we go, we see money being used as a medium of exchange. Money is at the core of our existence. Every day, we transact with one another. Currently, almost all of our daily transactions involve a third party, a bank, credit card company, or remittance provider. And ultimately, it's these institutions that carry out the transaction on our behalf. This is until the invention of Bitcoin. Bitcoin is truly one of the most important inventions ever in the history of humankind. That's how big of an impact it's going to have on our lives. And it sounds really difficult and complicated and hard to understand hearing about it. If you had only heard about email, it would sound difficult and complicated and hard to use. Bitcoin is literally easier to use than email. So what exactly is Bitcoin? Well, for starters, Bitcoin isn't actually a coin. Bitcoin is a new form of money, a currency that lives solely on the internet, one that some have even called magic internet money. I think part of the confusion is that Bitcoin is actually two different things. It's both a currency and a payment network. And we've never had one thing that's both of those at the same time. So the dollar is a currency, but it's not a payment network. PayPal and Visa are payment networks, but they're not currencies. Bitcoin is both of those things at the same time, but it has this other property. And that other property is that it can instantly be teleported anywhere in the world, just like that, almost for free. And there's nothing that anybody can do to block these teleportations. There's nothing anybody can do to intercept these teleportations. And if you're careful about how you use Bitcoin, you can do these teleportations anonymously. So with Bitcoin, with a push of a button, you can pay anyone anywhere in the world or receive payment from anyone anywhere in the world. In the aftermath of the global financial crisis, an author using the pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto posted a nine-page document onto an online forum. The document, titled Bitcoin, a peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system, would soon become the building block for what is today the first fully working concept of decentralized money. I sound one, 数字财富万能钱包，一键买卖比特币。